welcome back to Urban Rhino Tutorials. Um, on this episode, I want to show you how to load our Urban Rhino Photoshop brushes. Um, so once you purchase one of the collections of brushes, um, you just want to go to the folder, find where they are, um, and all you have to do is, um, with Photoshop open, just double click on the um, the the brush right there. Um, so right here it says Boca. If I double click that, okay. And then what's going to happen is it's going to load here. Um, so when I um, when I close Photoshop, sometimes depending on how fast your computer is, sometimes it will it will automatically load. Um, other times you have to close Photoshop and reopen it and then you'll see them on there. Um, my computer's kind of running slow because I'm filming right now. So um, these are the default brushes that are always on there. Let me um, close Photoshop um, and come back here in just a second and show you what this is going to look like. Okay, so I closed Photoshop and reopened it. Now if I go to my brushes up here, um, and click on the little drop down menu. When I scroll down, you will see these new brushes that are added, these Boca brushes. Um, so, how those work is let's say um, I want to open a picture here and just add some Boca to it. Um, I'm going to just randomly select one of these. So, let's just do um, one of these bigger ones. And right now, by default, it's very large. Um, so I'm going to make that smaller. I'm just using my left bracket key to make those smaller. Um, choose the color that you want. You can use your eyedropper tool and select a color. Um, I like to, um, a lot of times I'll sample a color, like I'm using one from her dress here. And I'm gonna lower the opacity. Um, the other thing that you can do is create layers, create blank layers and um, build these up. That way you can erase out some if you want. Um, I, I do a whole um, tutorial that's a more in-depth one on really using brushes. Um, so make sure you check out that one. But let's see, let's just click anywhere so you can see how light that is in the background. If I raise the opacity and let's say I use um, a brighter color of her dress, if I can get one sampled here. So you can see when I click on that, how cool that is adding that bokeh on there. Um, if I wanted to delete some of that out, remember you could create a new layer and then you can create a layer mask and um, delete out some of those. So if you don't want it to overlap on her skin, if you want to make it look like it's the background, you could do that. So um, you can check out our tutorials on working um, more in depth with brushes or um, how to create a layer mask if you need to. So thanks for purchasing our Urban Rhino Photoshop um, brushes. Thanks we hope you guys enjoy them. Make sure you stay connected with Urban Rhino on social media. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, comment below, and of course, subscribe to our channel.